Hello, everybody. It is almost 3 o'clock in the morning. I took a nap, woke up. Well, I just woke up not too long ago. So now I'm kind of wide awake. So, yeah, I might finish reading this book that I've been reading. But, of course, I hadn't really looked all day, so I decided to look and see what Miss V has done. Okay. I'm going to do this commentary and reaction to a shopping haul that they did. Is it just me, or it seems like all they do is shop? Her channel should be now the um, cheap store shopping, especially Ross. We go to Ross every day or Walmart. I'm mad at Charlene. I was telling y'all at the beginning of the video. I'm mad at Charlene because if she went to the store, she no tennis shoes. Look. Vanessa wouldn't have ended up with an Adidas hat. Okay, did you hear that? I thought it was Adidas because I bought, matter of fact, my son and my two grandchildren Adidas sports outfits to match for Christmas. And she's calling them Adidas. It is Adidas. I don't know why you're messing up these people's names. It is not Adidas. Okay, but I want you to listen to these they prices. The back, so it won't show my ball spot. When she ever bought a sixteen dollar hat, y'all. And then I had to Oh shit. <laughs> I done clicked out of it. Okay, so now let me get this straight. You bought this stuff. Hey guys, I'm Laurie with Fashion Company Fincher, and I'm so excited to show you the home planner. I need to get Okay, now she dressed manly, becoming a manly, manly, manly woman. This is like Irish Springs commercial. Ah, manly man. That's back in the day. It's something like that. <laughs> but ma'am is now buying men's clothes. She's telling this humongous lie. I had to go to the men's department because they didn't have my size in the women and the jackets were too tight. That's because you asked and got fat sitting down there eating at Charlene house. But I would say something else about why you dress it manly. But when have you, well, at least I know I haven't. And all the time that I've watched her, when the hell you ever seen her go buy $50 pants and $55 jackets? Never. Even at 40% off, that's not even 50% off. So together, you bought a $60 outfit. She would have bought 25 pairs of underwear, 75 bras, some banquet chicken, and some sardines for that much. And now her ass is spinning like she rich, y'all. No pants. Mm -hmm. the ladies department. Mm -hmm. the ladies, the they didn't. Adidas. 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 Uh, it is Adidas. Small, though, Dumbass. Small. So I just from the men's department, these are $50. And she, she loved. And it's a large. Mm -hmm. so the mediums look like they was going to be too small. Yeah, that's because you, so you're sitting there um, in the men's eating good at Charlene House. Off. I got mm -hmm. a jacket, $55, 40% off. And you went looking I like ain't your mama. The ladies, Aditi shorts. Aditi's. I like the short shorts. They have the short the shorts. Men's the basketball shorts mm -hmm. for men's. I ain't never had nothing before, I don't think. And I wanted some short shorts. So these was $22. So you can show your ass that you ain't got. <laughs> so that was $22 and 40 <clears throat> Come on, y'all. A $22 pair of shorts? No, ma'am. She has never bought a $22 pair of shorts since I've been watching her. And then you took your ass up there looking like ain't your mama with them kookaburros hanging out the back and that bright yellow. I hate that. I don't think that is the ugliest head wrap, doodad. I don't know what the hell you call it. So that's all I never have I liked those. The shorts, the jacket, mm -hmm. and the pants, mm -hmm. the socks. 
Oh yes, yeah, what's with all the black socks? She bumped. Never seen her um buy that many pairs of socks, let alone black socks. So who's rubbing off on who? You can't even tell when they go somewhere because it looked like they go to the set. You ain't doing shit. Matter of fact, it looked like um, it looked like she'd be going to the same damn spot. So I don't know what the big deal is. What you gonna take Charlene to um to um Texas with her? I mean, really, it, I don't know why she. I don't know. She's gotten quite boring. All she do is shop at Ross. And buy shit that you never see her wear. Never see her put nothing to that none of that stuff on. She wear that same gold Chimu outfit over and over and over and over again. Oh, I wanted to do the um where is it? Oh, what is this? Hey you guys, I did mm. a little work on the room. Okay. It's Maybe it's my TV or what, but oh, where's the one with the bed? What's going on in the room so far. Or maybe she didn't Stay have the bed in there the yet. Okay, and... it's horrible. It is horrible. I'm like, what, what, what are you doing in there? And then talking about they bought an eight thousand dollar bed. You didn't buy no, I know you damn well didn't buy one, but the bed might have cost 8000 when the people bought it. But if Charlene crazy as hell, if she thought, if she let you pick her, um, talk her into that damn bed, and it was $8,000, because it is not, hmm. Oh, no, that's not it. It was not, um. Where's the stupid little... Remember how little she was when she first got? Oh, these are ugly ones. I'm just gonna go back. Is that? No, that's... How chunky she is now compared to one of them came up. She got so many at Miss Charlene House doing absolutely nothing. There was a picture that came up of her when she first got the court site. I guess because she was eating all them sardines and ham hocks and turkey necks and whatever. She wasn't eating no good food. Well, that's a, a good one. Three months ago, but that's still. So, y'all, I just got through pinning a comment to <laughs> a troll. <laughs> it's funny how they don't want to consider themselves trolls, but they watch you and don't like you. Well, you watch people and don't like them. But she was a lot skinnier. She got down there with the money, honey. And now she um is living large. But I don't understand this. Oh, there's my tree that I had in this bedroom that I took down today. That that's as far as it got. I don't understand this obsession with shopping that they're doing. I mean, and... They really don't buy shit, y'all. I mean, they buy they buy stuff, but 
And I see Miss Charlene buying a lot of stuff for her family, which is really nice of her. But 20 pairs of black socks, I, I don't understand why you need, especially McNasty. She don't wear socks half the time. So you need 20 pair? I, I don't get it. Where is this damn, um... I want... To say something about this $8,000 bed that she supposedly, Miss Charlene, bought. Because like I said, we know damn well she ain't bought no $8,000 bed. Oh, here we go. Okay, you guys. This is a sneak peek <clears throat> of the bed before I make it. Maybe it's me. They have these little slots right here where you can put candles down up in them. Why would you put candles in there? Granite. Granite or marble? marble top, solid. Granite marble made. top. Granite and marble are two different things. With the little peekaboo holes where I can put some candles in. I'm going to have to find some kind of candles. We just went to Walmart and I was going to get like some red candles. Red had three there. candles. Why would you put. A, so is that. Are the curtains red or they look rough? So anyway, I'm about to make the bed. And this is okay, I'm confused about this damn decorating this room <clears throat> because the walls are gray. And this is just my thought on this. And the floor looks almost the same color as the bed. Seeing that she wasn't going to allow her to paint the walls, I probably would have went with a darker wood because you went and bought supposedly the $400 um not dresser, but credenza that she got over there that does not match the bed because now the bed makes the credenza credenza look like it's uh, miniature because it's so small compared to the bed. And those colors are horrible in there. The rust and the gold, and I guess those are rust. She said yellow curtains, but I'm like, her and this yellow obsession, you don't need to decorate everybody's house in yellow, okay, like I said, I would have went with darker because of the floor and the walls. Because actually, the bedding that she has is going to blend in with the bed and not look that hot. And if she's going to do a rust, then she should have did a different accent color. Because rust kind of has a yellow under color to it. So... If she was going to use the rust, I probably would have used a grounding color like black. Or she could have went with gray. Since the walls are gray, just a dark gray. Similar. But I don't know. No, she is not a decorator. The best thing going in there so far, I do like the credenza. And I like the lighting that the people gave her. And as she said in one of her videos, um... Miss um, Charlene is making out because she's getting free stuff from the companies and she's giving it to her. And so it's free. And matter of fact, she made a point to say that if it wasn't for her, Miss Charlene wouldn't be getting the free stuff because she's only getting it because the companies are giving it to her free, mind you. So she's giving it to her. Well, you just should as much money as this woman spent because I guarantee you didn't buy no Adidas. I bet you Charlene bought all that because where's your money coming from? Because your videos are boring as hell. And you don't even lost your little your little bit of um um what's the what's the word I want to use? Your little bit of creativity when it comes to decorating. Cause this shit, no ma'am, that bed that bed is too big for that room. It really is. You should have went um in a different direction, used a different grounding color. Or either use, if you're going to use gold as your accent colors, then you could have went with dark gray. Um, with, um, damn, that is three o'clock in the morning. She could have went with dark gray as her colors scheme from the bedding. Even if she kept that, I don't, I don't, like I said, I don't particularly care for the bed in that room. 
Um, if that's the case, then just leave the bed and take that small credenza out. Or put it in the closet or something. I don't know how big the closet is. But I would have used darker bedding and curtains like dark gray. And then she could have used the gold to go in there with it. You know, and then if she just wanted to throw some rust in there, use that in the pillows. You know, mix the pillows with gold rust and that's the gray. Actually, that's a pretty good blend together. But yeah, ma'am needs to um get her shit together because that, 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 that is saw red and it don't look good. And don't come in my damn chat telling me about um what you think about it. This is my damn reaction to her video and my commentary. And I think it looked like shit. And she ain't doing nothing but shopping. I mean, how many damn sweat pair um, athletic pants can you buy? To where, where, where the fuck are y'all going? This is the other side of Kurt To go sit in the woods? Well, not even in the woods. To go sit in the in the desert. Well, hmm. Yeah. To go sit in the desert and we don't even see you. Ooh, it's supposed to be bad weather. Where is this at? Rested tonight into tomorrow. Race its way right up the mountains here. We're going to be on the northwestern edge of this uh, through the day tomorrow. With that must be why we're getting rain all day tomorrow. The heaviest snow moves. If any of you guys are living up north, northeast on Sunday, and that with some lake enhancement, mm. we'll keep the of some snow showers in the forecast. My sister is going to be upset and have to call her because. She hates for me to say the word snow this time of the year because she lives in Michigan. But yeah, I just wanted to know if you guys had seen the um, ridiculous hoarding show that she got going on. That's what she could call it. She's been thinking and trying to think of a different name. The Hoarders, the Walmart Hoarders, the Ross, I don't know. What's another word for Hoarders? Um, the Wasteful Raw shoppers, I don't know, because they buy the same shit over and over and over again. And I'm like, just because it's three dollars, it does not mean you have to buy it. It, it especially if you live in a van. And then the thing that killed me, did you see the kicker? As soon as she got to her stuff about her buying the Adidas, she put up there her cash app and um all her little stuff for you to send her money. But you notice she ain't begged for no money, so now. You want the people to support your shopping hauls at Adidas for you to go nowhere? How about you do a shopping haul at a beauty supply store? Hmm? Go in there and get some shit for your head so that you can comb it out. Yeah, how about that one? We never see you do stuff like that. Getting stuff for you to clean your face. Maybe, just a suggestion... You can upgrade from fucking VO5, washing your whole body with it because it's a shampoo. Matter of fact, an old brand of shampoo. And you don't go around watching your cooch with VO5. How about going, since you are now the Walmart, you know, Wonder Girl, go in there and get some body gel, body shower gel. Or maybe while you're at Ross, they have the, right now, they should have all the stuff that they didn't sell for Christmas and they have the cute little sets. Why don't you get some decent body wash and lotion and then stop at the beauty supply store and get some stuff to comb out the kinks. Like a comb, matter of fact, get a comb and a brush while you're in there. And some stuff that you need to wash your hair and make, quit making it just walk around like you trying to grow dreads in the desert. I mean, yeah, how about some of that stuff? You never buy the essentials that you really need. You continuously buy them shit that you don't need. And my gosh, you talking about buying another pair of tennis shoes. Why? You don't even wear the pairs that you got. That is just ridiculous and wasteful. Especially when you don't have a job and other people are doing this time for you. Well, I don't see the subscribers sending in loads and loads of money anymore. I'm so glad that the two subscribers that you refuse to say their name have left you and quit wasting their money. Y'all can now look and see that your money was not used very well. And right now, 
you would be paying for a DD shopping spree versus assisting her in any type of way because that ain't shit that you need. I look at the other van people because there's quite a few now and they are so very resourceful and they're doing stuff. You're going to stay on the same BML land, I guess wearing your DTs out there and cooking um, dirty chicken in an old cast iron pan. Yeah. You know, I maybe shouldn't make videos at 3 o'clock in the morning because I'll be kind of going a little haywire, don't I? Yeah. I might need to start rethinking that. <laughs> Bye, y'all.